drive in fear in other people. I am saying that shit is not working. It is not working. You need to legalize firearm. Same like how Florida do it. Same like how Atlanta do it. Connecticut do it. You have follow America with everything else. But you now follow America with the gun law situation. You know, there's something wrong with it. You have follow America with everything in the Angeles. Remember, you force the vax on the people. Eh? Try to trick the people and eh, figure take vax. Try to clue clocks the people and eh, picnic. Because one of the time you have say, certainly picnic if you get vax. Now it's clear in the world. Say, the whole joke business was a lie. And be a lawsuit I go on. And people are got prison. If you ask me, Dr. Christopher Tufton and the Prime Minister Andrew Wallace, they got jail. Because them did a push this joke on the people them. And I speak as if it is something good. And I try fear in the people for make it mandatory for even school kids. Now, when you have a leader who is not scared are even caring about the kids because you want to sacrifice the people them in because you come on TV come say your people them take it in which is a lie you know see and the ministry of health the leader of the ministry of health Dr. Christopher Tufton I want to know where the people them there where did I force people so them to take it like Miss Kitty and Ding Dang, them and Ramesh, them and the whole of them, where they are saying, Yeah, you have to take it and you have to this and that, because it will save life. When that time Miss Kitty gets so emotional, that she has cost the, 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 the unjuk people, them, the people them when I get the joke, as illiterate, and I put people life as risk, and them all kill off people. And how do you feel now if you know say, it was a big lie? It was a big hoax. See, it, it out in the public, you know, See them a pay back people in New York, all of who they get fired from them job. They have to pay them back for all of the time where them never work. And reinstate them in a them job. In a the same position where them is there. Wanna never know that. Wanna they fit talk now. This is why I may tell us I'm a leader, I'm in a follower, you know. Me a leader, I'm in a follower, I'm in a stupid, you know. The way them come out strong. And at this, everybody where say them now nah, deal with no joke. And now we see say the joke was a lie. We see say everything about the joke was a lie. None of them not talk. All the people when they come out so strong, wanna there know that it is proven that the whole thing was a lie. Yeah, but King Chop, if you get fired, there's money there for you. The, 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 the judge in a New York, um, and the a judgment that them have to pay anybody where they made fire for not taking the joke. Them have to pay them back for all of the time when you never work. So if you never work for that two years there, them have to pay you. Plus, them have to reinstate you in your job. Who do not watch news? I don't see what I go on. I don't see what I go on. They used to call it conspiracy theory. But it's true. Remember, say, Jamaica the last place still I take how much, how much cargo full of the, of the joke them, you know? Even when the rest of the world allow it, you know? Jamaica take from how much place when I want it, you know? And then I force it upon the people, them, you know? How can you all support a government who put your pity them for dead? Me, all right. Government always try to kill adults all the time. But when you see a leader become such a puppet, till him want to throw your pity them under the bus. Remember when I tell them and I say them have vaccines. I never want to say that, you know. Come on, them block me, um, my page, you know. Them I say them have joke. 
especially for kids. Especially for kids. Now, if me have a prime minister, we don't care about my pitney. And if my pitney them one dead, then me not vote for you, brother. Hey, me have so much reason why me would have never vote for Andrew. Me have so much, so much logical reason why I would never vote for Andrew Holmes. It's just the honest truth. I could never give Andrew Holmes my vote. Sexy Trini, what's popping? Shout out to all my Trini pasty on the live, you know. All my Trini people. Let me see you wave your hand and put them in the air. Let me see you jump up and jump up and jump up and jump, jump up and jump up. <laughs> now we don't need apology. We need for the Prime Minister and the Minister of Health go to jail for imposing such a atrocity on the people of Jamaica without proper proof or nothing. But you and me know them Freda. A three president in the world never accept the joke, you know. And the three of them dead now. Them kill them. But what me I say is we have to have a lady at my job was reinstated and got a lot of money through your talk for that. But I remember some of just come on life, come chat anything, you know. Me have my, my information them right before me run up on life, you know, but you. You see me? So I know what I say. They have to pay back people. Right now, the owner of Pfizer in a be a problem at court because now he must admit say, there was nothing, there was no proof for sure say, that's something that they might get to people. I got to stop. The disease, our help, the disease, there's no proof of that. You understand? Here, yeah, King Chuck. There's no proof of that, so that's why I'm gonna just jump up and when people chat me run with it. I gotta do my research first. I follow my instinct and I pray upon it and the ancestor them tell me what you do. Me know it was an illusion a long time. Now the people them in a Wuhan, in a China, I tell you straight, say, I make them make the disease and spread it upon the people them. You understand me? I tell you. And them I tell you straight, say, the United States of America fund the project. And them spend the money to create this whole thing. Yeah. So, if you don't know what research and understand, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where I go on. If I believe there's something out there, something is always out there. Remember, I say every single time you have. Every rainfall, disease come with it. Every time you have storm, all them things they are travel across the earth, you have disease that come with it. These diseases are not detrimental or I must dead or something will pass to your body. Sometimes it takes six to seven days or probably nine days and it gone about its business. You have an immune system. It depends on the power of your immune system that you will survive or die. Because what, what happens is when your body contracts the disease, if your immune system is not strong enough to fight it off, you have to start consume things to give your immune system power. So that's why them tell you to run go to hospital, go take a pill and take a pill. But all you have to do is find the right set of bush them and boil the right set of tea and eat the right set of food and power up your immune system and it push out the disease out of your body. It's like, remember, you know, people just don't know. If you catch a cold, you're not going to get rid of the cold no matter what you take until five to seven days. It not going to It might eat what you take might calm the symptoms of the cold, meaning like the giant pain, the stuffy nose, the sore eyes, the sore throat, those things can be treated. See? Those can be treated. So when they hear them, I say, okay, go get that night quill here, yeah? or get a terror flu here, yeah? it now make the cold go away. You know? It'll go soothe the symptoms of the cold. 
so you can sleep better or operate better. What him say? What him say? Richly, what him say? Question footer. What if the opposition party come in power and start the same thing like Andrew? Then who do we vote for? Then if the opposition party come in and lame like Andrew them, we vote them out too. And that's why you have the power of voting. You know which constituency the, the Prime Minister run. Andrew run, Andrew run down an Olympic way there, so. On a water outside there, so. Then if Andrew are the worst thing and now go on good. The people them in other constituencies, they have to vote him out. Make him lose him seat. If him lose him seat, him can't be Prime Minister. The power is in the hands of the people. Now, if Mark Golden come in and now uh, go on with nothing, the people in a film constituency have to vote him out. That's what people don't understand the power of voting. You understand what I'm saying to you? So, you can't, you can't deliberately make a, a prime minister lose because if him lose him seat, him cannot be the prime minister. We not to have no diarty, nothing. We if you switch it, switch it. Anytime one now go and go do switch to the next one. I don't want to come in and now go and go do switch back. I saw it work. No diarty to nothing. No stay over in one place with nothing. The whole of them are politicians now. The whole of them are puppets you now. The whole of them are work for the Queen you now. The whole of them are work for England. But what we have to do is make sure we get the most out of whichever one of them is there. You're not going to get 100% everything. Because remember, them are puppets, them are working for others. But we can get the most out of whichever one we can. You understand me? And that we have to try remember. So if Andrew, not if, when Andrew lose him seat, Mark Golden or one of them come in, and them are the PFL in the same way, we clap them. You see me? Next election, them dead. Out. You see me? Straight. That's how you do politics. That's how you do Starboy Flex, big up. I saw you do politics. No dieted nothing. But me a shower, me a pout. No dieted nothing. You watch results. You watch benefits to the people there. You understand? We have to watch how, where you do a benefit the people there. Because big man thing, me see Andrew should something that the man just come like him and say, yo, a badness me I use. No response to people. And him just had to do something and him not care. Him just had to do something and him not care. Since the state of emergency, about four or five innocent youth, me see them kill. Me now say innocent in terms of they have never done anything. I'm saying in terms of when them are shoot them and them, the man them they have gone. Now nah, knife, me see, me see one youth that flings two and police shot him and kill him. You yeah, idiot. Which part else in the world see them thing they happen? Which man with stone can make police kill him? You're mad. <coughs> police they got prisoner rotten like dog. Stone, first thing if you're gonna shoot the man, shoot the man in the foot. You understand me, I say? Our pepper spray him, our restrain him. There's a million things you can do before shooting somebody. As a police officer, if you're a civilian, then you can shoot anybody when you feel like. And go to prison, go out and do anything you want to do. What me I say as a police officer? Oh, you feel just get up and shoot, man. He's not dead. Well, you them say he's not dead. But them kill one out of assault. Assault? I run a um, spoiler side there, so. Shoot the man. Shoot the youth in them face, all of the woman them out there ball. You understand what I mean, I say? And the woman's witness a video, them still shoot the man in them face. And also police work for go bridging. If, if boy have gun and back gun from police, of course, shoot them and kill them. I mean, I'm not biased. Because shoot out a, a save a save a life. But how can you not be in a shootout and go for somebody and just kill them, so? No, be. Them thing that not work. So when you give them state of emergency, police and soldiers can't do that. Because there's no limit. It's a state of emergency. And our police in Jamaica, you have some good one. But the bad one, them outnumber the good one. And Jamaican police, 
when they mean a state of emergency, them just go around and kick down people and box down people and you know how much of them police are raped girl in that ear of them? I bad up the girl them and, 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 and six them off. And the girl them can't say nothing. Cause a state of emergency, kicking people in the door. Can I lie down there, people in bed asleep, bag a thing. Holy but thing police go on with a journey kinda. You see me? So we rate the good police them in about. Majority of police, them are Jamaica. Them are, them are dirty style. And when you get, when you issue a state of emergency, police just feel like them for do anything them feel for do. Soldier do anything them feel for do. Kick down anybody them need to kick down. Boss up people, head shoot people, murder people, not knock them out. So, me not agree with that state of emergency bullshit. You see me? Right now, a World Cup make crime ease up a little bit. Call like gunman, they might watch much. Gunman going to him out, see a next man, a him girl. Through the match, I go on him, no business about that. As the match done, him kill her beaten. That time, the man gone. You understand me, I say? So, a footballer stop everything right now. Crime not drop down nothing. I just footballer go on him, and then time for kill nobody. Because every TV, Every TV out for every corner. So no man now uh, I hide and I run up and down and can't get to watch Brazil or Argentina or nothing. You see me? You see me? So, and you come and go and like him do something for crime ease up. You know, do nothing for crime ease up. Bitch. Man, him just a watch football, my lad. As football done, watch it. As football done, watch you going again. Christmas now, no? Holiday and honor. Ha! Wait till football done. Move the mind the game them stretch out some more. Move the mind them start play the game them every two weeks. So that's all by February, March we still have World Cup and going car. When this done. <laughs> Member. Hmm? Member, you know. Remember every gunman need new clothes. They need the new clocks, then they need the new marina them. Them have, them have Christmas Eve, them have Christmas, them have Boxing Day, them have the day after Boxing Day, them have New Year's Eve, New Year's, the day after New Year's, them have Prada, them show for go, Eastern Extravaganza, them have Sting for go, and they must feel like a Jew. I think none of them gun money want to go out in dirty clothes, and a whole tear up, tear up clothes that them wear from last year or January gone, and they pan that. Remember them have picnic, Remember them pick them on new clothes and ties and be something. Remember a gunman them want buy paper light to and them something. Blood clad stay there. Wait till the World Cup done. <laughs> you know, come and use the opportunity of going like you tone down the crime. And I run up on TV every minute. But oh, crime rate. And this is the amount of people that died this month. So I'm to the whole of here from January to now. Explain that. Since I you do it and I you find formula. So where the formula is there? And I first remember you did have Zozo. A man a kill man right side of Zozo. So that them jump asleep. As them jump asleep a man shoot a man. Or they are more in a state of emergency. Them drive down man by highway. Shoot him up and him five year old. How you not talk about that? Talk about that now, Andrew. Talk about that. Right now the Zozo zone. The man them drive down. And shoot up care, kill man and him pity. Why oh, you not talk about that on the news? So the numbers ease up and I stop you, stop crime. Are the crime man them stop and watch TV? And are you do nothing? Thank God for World Cup. Thank God for World Cup. Else you would not talk or you talk. So the only way me see where you can ease up crime at Jamaica. After World Cup, then you have to keep a World Cup. You have to go pay Brazil and pay Argentina and call it the Caribbean World Cup or something. Or Jamaican, in, or Jamaica Invitational World Cup and get the whole IT in them to come. You hear? That me, I tell you. Cause you come and come, but oh, we, we, look at the drastic reduction in crime. You never know nothing. Look at the drastic watching of TV. I doubt you ever thought, bro. 
Just watch the drastic watching of TV. I always know that about drastic reduction in crime like end or not. Oh, Piss me off every time you hear talk like I am not listen. I am not listen. The only way to solve this crime situation is to arm the citizens of Jamaica. The law abiding citizens must must be equipped to bear arms and defend self and property. Until you do that, you are going to always have crime problem because there are too many illegal guns on the streets of Jamaica. And it's a clear cut. But only don't want to get all illegal guns off the street of Jamaica because these same illegal guns secure on a seat in the election them. Because when they use the gunman them to drive fear in the voters, and if the voters are equipped with them on license firearm and thing, then they're not an attack from the thugs. So the thugs them are under control, are gonna lose power, and then uno are gonna lose power as politician to secure in a seat via violence and fear. So you don't want that the truth. No politician don't want that the truth. Say, Zine, that are the problem. That are the problem why crime can't stop. Before them solve the crime, them think about securing vote, securing them seat. That's why them like strong old garrison. And they must say, oh, run us a labor right here and they done a labor right. So the politician just call it down and say, yo, we have two barrel of thing, you know. Just make sure the man them walk and make the people them seat. And tie on two green flag on the K, the man. Thing and make sure them know, say, a labor right K, them, or a PNP K, them. And the people them get freed. Is a fear thing. So on the note, say if every single citizen have license gun, no little corner boy, no dirty 87, no cursing Nile bad man, can't come give them no talk. Call the granny we shoot in the face. You come my granny fence come stand up, she shoot you. Uno no wonder. Uno no wonder to know, cause they know Uno no go have no control over the garrison. So that's why when me see the man who run FLA just come out and say, no, him not agree with that. Who is you? Who is you for come say that? You don't even say you're going to review it and look into it and make a decision. You just come out bluntly, but no. Why are you, you, why are you doing FLA? Who you think you is? Your uncle can't stop some people from getting gone. You can't stop everybody. And you're going to lose your job some at some point. You can't be up there forever. And that statement there alone where you make, me feel you get fired. Well, Curse, I don't know the whole name them in mean, a richly. Curse Nile or whatever. 87, whatever them is. Lampile, Curse Nile. Castor Isle, I don't know. Engine Nile, I don't know. You see me? But the man who run FLA, me never liked that speech that when him come out. He just jump up and say, no, he must shut down. Man, you do your work for your system. You don't own FLA, you know. You work for your system. So if the people are request a certain thing with the help crime, oh, you feel just shut it down. So yet, you know, you know, you know what I say? You're not even give it thought. You're not even say, all right, we're going to look into it. Even if you're not do it, just say, I'm going to look into it. And look into it. You just shut it down, no, sir. And you are not the Prime Minister, you are not the leader of the opposition, you are not the leader of the private sector organization of Jamaica, you know. But me not understand, you have a job. You just jump up and say no. Be power. Why you jump up and say no? Why you just jump up and say no? Can you feel like, say, your little money, them where you get and your little cut and your little control. You're like a power ego now I got caught. If them set up the thing where once you're a legal citizen, you can go for your gun. You are gonna lose power. Cause you like when people call you and I kiss your ass and I beg you and I pay you to clear them for them, get them gone. So I that are your problem. Well, I that are the corruption you need to come out of the system. Every legal citizen, whether you're rich or poor, 
supposed to be qualified as long as you don't have no conviction to get your license for your arm. Whether the president of FLA like it or not, like it or not, it's not a personal thing. This is a decision that will benefit the entire country. So no one man, Tommy Collection, what are we there? No one person is supposed to make them decision to be a ego or be a spy hustling or be a spy or you are eating your food. So you want to eat food and everybody else is dead over food. Because if you eat food and I get who you feel for the life of gun clearance. And the people that are really in danger can't protect themselves and are dead because man want to come rob them look at food. How that go? How that go? I don't understand. How you blatantly come out, me see it on the newspaper front. You say no to Ray Ray Ray. Oh, that another decision for you and me, brother? That another decision for you and me? Every woman, every man, every teenager over 18, fi be eligible to get them license gun. Once them have a clean record, no conviction, see? Them fi able fi all them need a proper background check. That's it. Everybody, if you can get them license, gonna live a one dollar in your account. It no matter your bank account, not supposed to matter if you have license, gonna or not. For you can find money for buy your gun and buy your ammunition and have your safe and your something and your protective thing. You have to have gun. That way, they know everybody have to respect everybody. That time, the gunman have got dash with them gun in a bush. Cause if everybody have license gun and them not have none, them all got prison and dead. You understand me? I say, everybody who is a legal citizen in Jamaica must be eligible to bear arms and protect themselves and them possessions. Everybody, no prejudice with a woman, man, granny. As long as you're over 18, you go and you, the choice is yours if you want to license gun or not. It nothing be where you have to feel like you have to reach like Matal and them or reach like the Bovell them before you can go, go apply for license gun. When you have a rich uptown family of two, three handgun, two, three shotgun plus bird gun plus all kind of gun, and you, the little man, don't have none. The, the man uptown can kick you down and box you down and butt you up and beat you up and go bite out. But while if him nothing, everybody have gone him have to respect the little man just like how the little man have to respect him. The police them disrespect people and deal with people wicked because of them when have gone and them have authority back at it. If them know say everybody legally have gone, them have to deal with people different. Not to mention the little 87 boy them. We have illegal gun and I go like them a God Almighty because them have a little one gun and nobody else in the community now no gun. That have to stop. That is where the problem is. That have to stop. If you no see se, if you no see se, that is a problem. And it have to stop. Then you no go solve crime. When a man living in a lane and feel father dead left seven or eight gun give him. And every youth will never see gun yet. And him and give them a little three eight if you hold Then him tell us it, yo, Tom. Give, give, give Damien the thing tomorrow. Damien, tomorrow you give Steve the thing. Steve, tomorrow. The whole of them feel like him a God. Cause him alone have the, the thing a swing round. So him have to be the done. Cause him have the whole of the machine them. And every youth, because gun is so rare to have. Every youth feel like him had the done because him have five, six, seven gun. So them have him as, as, as God Almighty. All of them are idiot. All of them are beat. To a him own the thing them. People are going to show him loyalty. And the youth, them, the look at 87, them are going to show him loyalty. You understand how him will become the done because him have the thing them. Sonia seems to big up herself. Sonia seems to 23, she bought some badges. I am saying, it's no rocket scientist need to say this. You have to arm everybody. At the rate of Jamaica crime is, the only way to stop it is to arm everybody. Make sure everybody are bare arms. Everybody. Whether you're entertainer, 
or you work in a supermarket, or you work a garage, or you work on rubbish truck, it no matter. Whether you're a taxi man or white, no matter. Everybody they have legal firearm. People alive, I got done. Big up on yourself. Welcome to Jamrock Crew Sales today. Big up Junior Gang Marley, Stephen Marley. No love, people. Big up on yourself. CT this weekend. New York this weekend. Lord, big up. Choppy line, yeah. Choppy. <laughs>